This is DSN TV, showcasing the ability in disability. Proudly brought to you by the PA people. Welcome back to the USABA Gold Ball Nationals live from Atlanta on Disability Sports Network. My name's Tony Telfo and we're proudly brought to you by the PA people and also supported by the Ipsa Gold Ball Subcommittee. And I'm going to be joined uh, next game by uh, Mr Black I believe uh, indeed so uh, Mr Black's going to give commentary, colour commentary this time and uh, yes, sir. he'll listen to uh, to the call. Now we don't actually have numbers for the players from the orphan side which is in fact the pool team but I can let you know that we do have uh, Bill now Froine Froline yeah Froline Bill Froline. Froline. Yep. Yeah. and also we have Carl Hedrick Okay. We also have, uh, let me just have a look and see, we have Wyatt, now, Hildebrick. Wyatt Hildebrick. Yep, and also we have Alex Richmond. Now, that's according to my list that I have here. Uh, so Alex Richmond has been moved to the New York Empire. Yeah, that's what I thought. He'd gone there. And they are playing, who have we got them playing against? We have uh, them playing against Michigan Omega. The Omega. Okay, let's just have a look at... Uh, there's what I'm sure I've got them here somewhere. Just uh, bear with me for one second while I go through it. Now, Black, not not the greatest start for your boys, but there's a long way to go in the tournament still. Agreed, agreed, man. It's a, it's a uh, a rough road sometimes for us, uh, especially starting off early in the morning, um, just trying to wake up and you know get on the court and do what we have to do. Uh, which is one of the reasons I would have preferred to play those guys at night. But, uh, yep. hey, you know, sometimes you just can't control fate. All we have to do is go out and make sure that we perform to the best of our abilities in these next games. All right, so now for Michigan, we have uh, John Kusku, number eight. Yep. We also have uh, Ahmad Michel, Michel number six. Yep. And also we have Alex Williams. Yep. Uh, number seven and they're coached by Jessica Kusku. Now, we'll just have a look and see now. As I said, uh, so they're the two two teams that we've got now. Because we don't have numbers for the the orphans team, then what we'll do is we'll just, uh, we'll actually go by, uh, you'll find that I will call by left and right and centre players and uh, we'll get uh, comments from Jeron uh, Black throughout the game uh, and we must thank uh, everybody who's helping us out uh, Jeron, also Tony Brun and and just uh, Jeron as I said before just be careful we don't move that camera otherwise we'll be in big trouble yeah man <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I don't knock it over okay yeah, so started. here we go so it's gone to the centre now this looks like it is the team down here this is the um, on this side this the offense there's a wild ball and a wild throw by the right winger here now. No, I actually think the orphans are at. Uh, oh, they, yep, the orphans are at the this end here. So yes, sir. Now we've got the right winger with the ball goes across. Comes in now. Discus throw goes down the line, aiming for the A B gap, but kicked out yeah, above yeah. them and uh, into into space. Yeah. Ball so, now. So far, these guys looking good. No goals. Bouncing ball straight down the line. It's interesting pick up by uh, the right wing and went across the the back of the court, but it's with the centre for the Omega down the line, up and over oh, and into the back. This came off, come off uh, number thirty seconds into the first one, into from the centre. Thirty yeah. seconds into the game. Um, let's see how these guys can hold up. Let's see. I'm just trying to work out who picked we've got. Up. If you can just see if we can work out who's on court at the picked far right end for there. us. Number. Seven now for the orphans. Goes with a ball aiming for the BC gap. Doesn't get it through on this occasion. But picked up uh, by the centre for the Omega. Comes in now. Goes with a discus throw. Bounce ball across. Oh, oh, it's okay. up and Crossbar over the off center. the top of the crossbar. The centre so is popping the ball a lot in this uh, first half of this game so far. He has to get it together. Mm, certainly is. So here picked we go. Up by the left winger. Goes down the line. Goes across Back court. So Passed off. Movement. Now Omega is one of those teams that move a lot as they scramble for the ball. And this is going to be a 10-second yes, call. Yes, it will be. Uh, these guys have to make better plays, push it out. 
Yeah, 10 seconds, it always gonna, yeah, it's going to be 10 and seconds. That, see, and that's discretionary now because uh, the ref has said ball over, as she said, 10 seconds. So it's like, what do you go with, you know? Uh, the offense have to really come together in yep. this game. They're going into the center to discuss this. Now, can you hear me all right uh, there, yes, Mr. Blake? Yes, I, I do. Beautiful. So now, to me, it's a 10-second penalty, and it should be so. Um, I would disagree. No. I would go with the referee's call. Uh, just for the player's sake, you know. Now it's a high, high ball. There ball. you go. Well, there you go. Well, now that's fair enough too because he was above the high ball line and he actually pushed the pushed ball the along ball. the ground. So, yeah. which meant that uh, he was there. Sorry. See, uh, these are the little things that players need to uh, watch out for. I don't know if they don't discuss these things in practice, but you need to be very careful. Yeah. So here we go. Sir. Sets up at the center with a wide stance. Right here we go. The penalty now to be taken from the center. I missed John Cools was well. Hooks it across. Right oh, fingertips it and uh, fingertips it in, but uh, fair effort. Yeah, so. I agree. He got a hand on it. Two zero uh, yeah. in the first minute of the game. Yeah, well that's it. So here we go. The ball now with the right winger sets himself. He Walks makes across. The sweep. Yep, going to go to the left wing to take the throw. Winds up now. Discus throw. High cross ball. ball. Yeah, it looked questionable, man. That really went out. That was a questionable throw. Yeah, well, obviously it was uh, it was there, so. Yeah. Go now. Omega um, really needs this win. Yeah, well, it's been a stop-start uh, uh, stop game. That's uh, that's for certain. And when's your next game, uh, Jaron? 420. Oh, there you go. So you've got a bit of time. Moving, it goes across to the other side of the court from the left wing now. A flat ball Straight into down the centre. To the centre. A great stop. Uh, seems like the centre has a great stop with smooth balls. Yeah, it's a uh, it's of working. Balls are passed across to Kusku. Kusku with the ball now comes in, flat ball, but straight into the center. Gets a ramp oh, and up and over wow. and, and through the legs of the right wing. They have to they have to make adjustments, man. The the center needs to make adjustments. There you go, a perfect timeout after a three goal lead with uh, under two minutes. You know, it was not a two minutes into the game. These guys have a three goal lead on the, on the offense. The offense realistically uh, would want to try to get a, a a great game out of these guys just because they're not as offensively uh, packed. You know, the the simple thing is that there's no way there is. Uh, they're not. The offense has not been nothing to write home about. In all yeah. seriousness, it's, it's it's been solid, but it hasn't been outstanding. And the issues that are happening are obviously uh, that that is the reason for it. As I yeah, a lot of a lot of form breaks. Yeah, well, this is right. So, but we'll see what uh, what goes on yeah, from here. Early, so. It's early in the game. It's still anybody's game, ladies and gentlemen. Picked up by the right winger. Right winger makes the sweep, but it's an equipment check. So I think they will have to drop the ball back in. They will, and if they're smart, once they drop back in, as soon as they drop back in, they'll get rid of the throw straight away. Uh, is it, uh, the, the time is re, uh, reset 10 seconds yeah I understand that but I'm saying that I would just uh, wouldn't uh, give them a chance to set quick shot but sets up at the back center spins takes a nice shot high ball high ball call it was a good ball which, too which was the same exact shot he threw before and it wasn't a high ball before so uh, why would you call it now well where not the referees. As we yeah. know referees have the, the final say. There's been a lot of bad calls so far this tournament, in my personal opinion. He sets up at the center. Short stance. He gets down. Has, a, has Exactly a the it. same result as that last time. Got fingers to it and uh, yeah. managed to push it in. So, yeah. It should be 4-1. 4-0. Uh, it should be 4-0, actually. It should be the score, not 3-1. Four zero. Four zero. Yeah, so the score should certainly be four zero because uh they have certainly not uh four zero rest. That's right, you focus on your job here, young man. Uh, you focus on what your job is here, don't worry about it. These refs have been messing up all day, man. I uh, I've been very frustrated with these guys. No offense to them. I love the referee job, but that's a tough job. Great. Somebody's gotta do it. Yeah. But uh Minor things like this, we should be able to control on a on a certain level. 
yeah. as far as the score goes. Right wing in you know, for the orphans goes with the discus throw and straight into nice. the gap. Magnificent ball. Magnificent, yes, sir. Hit straight through the this BC on this gap. Right wing. I'm so curious. He has a decent throw. Yeah, yeah I'm not that. sure. Oh, popped up, blocked up. Yeah, went out a long way. Now that's Bill in the centre, I think, for the orphans. Yes. So uh, I'm pretty sure it's Bill playing centre. Not sure who's on this his guy wings. Seems lost. He's, uh, as he enters his way towards his line, blocked at the center, pop four, passed off to the left winger. Left winger winds up, throws, goes cross, go into the BC gap, picked up by the center. Nice hard shot into the three. Blocked Concern is for the center player Bill here. He's his legs, his bottom legs coming through late, which is kicking the ball up as the ball's almost played into the. Omega goal. Yes. But uh, not on this occasion. This ball well uh, wide. The Omega couldn't find the court on that ball. It was uh, far out by a long shot. Yeah. Picked yeah, up by the right game. winger. Let's see if the right winger can put another one in for his team early in the game. He's gone for the same sort of shot. Hit the same spot and got the same result. Nice. Magnificent ball straight into the BC That's gap. Great ball by this kid, man. This kid could really lead the team. Center just needs to get get it together on defense. Yeah, so the score is 4-2. The Omega maybe have gone with the wrong attitude. The bouncing ball there in this occasion, go. but again, again. Off the center feet. Yeah. It has to it has to make some adjustments to center. Yeah, Bill's just, his feet are, he's flicking his feet, and that's what's yeah. causing the ball to, to ramp off them. So, which is high ball, high ball called. These, these mistakes, man, these mistakes will take you out of the game. Yeah, but having said that, it's very difficult if you come into, into, into a pool team, having not, you know, not knowing who you're playing with. Again, same same result, goal but in the, the same spot in the AB the, corner. The thing about it is you can control your defensive form. You can't control maybe shifting and different things like that, but if the ball is clearly touching, you can control that. Picked yep. up right wing, picked up, sweeps the court. Uh, should have gone Spins. to the well again. Into the four. It's a BC gap, yeah. as you guys call it. He gets that. Seems oh, a little whichever, bit off. Whichever works, I don't, it doesn't matter, but I, I'd call it A, B, and C. Yeah, Next ball into the B. In. Laid off to the right. Much energy. Yeah, well, they certainly didn't on that occasion. Sweeps with the ball again. Into the B gap. Ball back to Kuzku. He's gone across behind the centre. He's going to take this throw from the centre. Goes with a discus throw. Bouncing ball. Again, Off flip feet. Up forward in the air by on Bill. The Doesn't uh, get through on this occasion. Ball. Yeah. So they, they, they do a great job blocking for a couple of plays. Into the C. So, again, they're shuffling around. Ball again straight, straight into straight B. Into and again, it's in the air by up. Bill. A great job. It seems like the more he's getting into the game, he's getting the rhythm. Straight into the B. Ball and just in. pushed wide. Oh, wow. It almost it almost made it in. And Seven got a long way in. He, he's coming, uh, came a long way in. Goes for a quick hook. Going for the A, B gap this time. Hook, uh, B, he's, C gap this time. Hooks it too pretty, wide. He's getting pretty close to the center, man. I hope they don't collide. Yeah, he's Boy, going to spin. So, substitution for Michigan. Omega. Nine out, four in. So, let me just... Have a look on my list here quickly as um, young Mr. Yeah. Hines is off doing other things. <laughs> yeah, man. So, you know, these penalties, man, they really will take you out of a game. Um, it doesn't matter the time of day. I agree with that. And we are back in play. Uh, ball is on the left side. Moving, motion, as this team normally does. A lot of motion. Thrown straight into the B and blocked by the center's feet. Uh, left I, would give you ball. I would give you the substitution, but according to this, and I don't it goes into the C gap. More, more motion. Okay, blocked again on uh, A side. Lines up. Throws it straight into the B. Cool, cool, the ball. 
But and this in off of the left winger's feet. It looked, uh, it looked like it was a goal that could have been shared by the left winger in the center. Either of those guys could have got to it. Right winger goes to get the ball to try to help his team out again. Once again, he sets up on the left hand side, takes the spin, throws the shot straight into the B. He crawls back to his spot slowly. He sets up back center. He's kind of lost as these guys wind up and throw back straight at him. He pops it up and makes the block. He gathers the ball. He throws it straight out of bounds at the referee's table. He has to be better getting back back to his spot. Set up from the other side. Move, uh, motion as this team normally does. Thrown straight into the three. And blocked out. Picked up by the right winger again. Nice spin. Thrown into the three again. Passed off to the right winger. Up, oh, right up off the hands, off the hands, uh, off the hands of the center man. The center has given up at least four uh, out of the six goals that that has uh, occurred for these guys, man. Sloppy hmm. playing by the center. So time out to the orphans uh, with the current score at uh, what are we looking at? What is it? Six two. Six two, I believe. Yes. Yep, six two with around about. Uh, and this. 46 seconds left in the half. Realistically, these guys still have a long half, and these oh, guys can make 12, a, a, a phenomenal comeback, but they have to adjust the center. They have to adjust these problems at the center. And if they don't, um, it would only get worse from this point on. Yeah, look, that's true. Um, so we've actually got around about uh, about 4 minutes 12 to go. I do apologize. I uh, misread the clock. But well, the Orphans now got to see what they can, uh, they can muster. Yeah, and they have actually only got three players, the orphans. So, and I think it was uh, Bill, Carl, and spin throw, a straight out of bounds, and it goes way line out by the water fountains. Huh. I guess these time these guys time to recuperate. It could be strategy, you know, take a nice breather without calling the timeout. Well, that's right. Picked up, yeah. thrown into the B. Blocked. Ball over. These guys can't afford it. These guys can't afford ball overs at this point in the game. It's a great ball, but nice piece of defensive work by the left winger to keep that ball at the four now for the offense comes in, sends the ball down to the A B area. Nicely blocked. Center player picks it up now. Moves across to his left. A flat great ball shot. straight through the, the goal. Straight through the Nobody BC was gap. Home. Nobody was there. So the score now moves on to seven goals to two. I they actually, um, oh, it's actually ten to. I do apologise. Yeah, I didn't realise they'd scored ten. And uh, that's actually a bit of a surprise because it doesn't uh, didn't appear that way. Well, that's I'm going by the by the scoreboard. So, uh, you know, just to speak on behalf of Omega at this point, uh, this is what they actually need because coming from an earlier mercy. These guys need to fix their goal differential if they plan on trying to make it into the top eight. Yeah, well, they're setting up a long way across the orphans. Slow right. bounce. Can they make it in? No. No, just pushed wide on that occasion. But the right winger and the center are very close together. Yeah. 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 When they're setting up in defense, it's a bit strange, I must admit. Now, I'm going to give the end of this game or the half I'm going to see if I can get in touch with Troy oh, and ball up and over, over on that occasion blocked over we'll see whether Mr. King's available I haven't heard back from him but we will try him at any rate he uh, might be up I don't know it's a great ball but just wide by the number 7 for, for the Orphans who's certainly got a power powerhouse throw on him yeah that's for sure so he's really trying to lead these guys they just need to fix defence they can score run around behind the center aiming for the uh the bc gap doesn't get through on this occasion bill gets up does the chasing picks it up and oh an ordinary pass luckily didn't go through but straight into the a bc gap picked up by the center lays it off to his left winger winds up now goes for that gap again blocked gap. for it just to push forward in front and it's slow he's, he's slow to get it but it almost paid off on that occasion as the ball almost went through. There's a quick, a quick pitch, and beat he did not get back. 
the whole game he's been uh, slow to get back. This right winger kid over here, yeah, he's been slow to get back, and now they finally exploded him for that. So you know, the score is now eleven two. Spin and throw, throws it straight into the B, and blocked out. So, can these guys put it away here? We'll see. Well, not uh, quite no. yet. As, uh, the center picks it up, goes for the uh, center high ball. That looked like to me. It's picked nope. up too far. There's some things they just don't call. It's fine. Blocks forward. These guys both chase the ball. The right winger passes it off to center. Center throws it straight into the corner and it goes out. And these guys typically run motion. He sets up on the left. Throws it. And it's in. And it's in, and that will be game, unfortunately. Game. What a slow what a slow roll. So that's game, unfortunately. And these guys, um these guys sometimes, man, uh Omega, they have the potential to stay in the game, man. If they play their defense, they they play great, you know. They'll always try to sneak a couple in and and that's usually what happens with these guys, man. Um the offense again they are a pool team just for everybody out there listening they're a pool team so they um haven't played with each other before but again no excuse um, if the ball is hitting your body man you should you're responsible for that block you know this is dsn tv showcasing the ability in disability proudly brought to you by the pa people